behind-the-scenes project announced recently by the major life insurance company Descendant of the Rose, better known as Descendant Corps. The new product, to be revealed as early as the end of the month, is rumored to be called the Project of Eternal Life, and some sources claim that it will change the world. A girl was brought into the emergency room late that night. A car accident. It was too late to save her parents. Guns! Blood pressure has dropped to 60. Her pulse is dropping. We've got to stop the bleeding. I know that! I've lost her pulse. Prepare the AD! What's wrong with the generator? It won't start. We got a pulse. The hell? There's a wound on her neck. there. That's when I saw it. Was I hallucinating? God, protect me from treachery and evil. There wasn't even a scratch on her. It's a miracle. I heard that Descendant donated a lot of money to the hospital, and the President even adopted her. It's too bad. She was such an important subject for research. The following day, it was decided she would be adopted by the President of Descendants Corporation, the company running the Project of Eternal Life. Do you like clothes? Only one survivor? God can be so cruel. It's the work of the devil. Speaking of devils, I think they staged the whole thing for the project announcement. How are you feeling today? Not so good. I don't care if I need to make a deal with the devil. I just want to live forever.
As a nurse, I am no stranger to death. I always believed that we were all sinners and that not one of us could escape death in this lifetime. A young girl resurrected miraculously. A rose that does not wither over time with undiminished beauty. Is this against your will, dear God? A legend of a rose that has not withered in a thousand years and the descendants of its guardians. They have existed since the dark ages extending their lives by feeding on humans and drinking their blood. Those who are bitten receive the gift of eternal life. Those who carry their blood are known as the descendants of the rose. They have a love for beauty and eternity, but in exchange for this it is their fate to accept darkness and isolation. Lord God, please protect me from temptation and forgive all my sins. Drawing that which is hidden deep within your heart. What is wrong, dear? I w won't be needing that picture. Outside of the hall, waiting for the descending core press conference to begin. And ladies and gentlemen, the excitement.